Well, one of the core features of the Samsung Galaxy S11 may surprise you, because it has to do with diets. Turns out the Samsung Galaxy S11 will have a spectrometer for its camera, which will measure the quantity of sugar in food. And Phone Arena has come up with a set of renders that adopt the new feature. Lately we've seen quite a few experimental designs for smartphones, including waterfall screens for the Vivo NEX3 and Huawei Mate 30 Pro. Then there the Xiaomi Mi Mix Alpha, which is all screen, no buttons. Where does the Galaxy S11 fit? It expected to get a more rounded and glossy design, new gradient hues and a centered front punch hole for the selfie camera. The main camera is horizontally oriented and it throws in quite a few powerful sensors. There an ultra-wide cam, wide-angle cam, 5x optical zoom telephoto cam and a depth vision camera, plus a spectrometer. Basically, it borrows the periscope zoom from the Huawei P30 Pro, in order to offer 5x optical zoom. The spectrometer is actually the hot new novelty, using infrared lighting to analyze the chemical composition of objects. It L blast objects with infrared light and analyze the result. That way it can tell how much sugar and nutritional values there in food, plus the alcohol content of a beverage. Also, it can detect skin moisture, oil content and maybe even ailments. Samsung Galaxy S11 is expected to have a more discreet and smaller punch hole camera, plus thinner bezels. We can tell if it will be a waterfall screen and ditch buttons or not, but we could also see that happening. More colors are slated to appear, according to Phone Arena, that rendered the device in orange, green, purple, red and blue. The Galaxy S11 feels more like a Galaxy S10s, seeing how it focuses on the camera upgrade. I feel we need even more innovation than just a mere 5x optical zoom and spectrometer, 